What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? This is Demo Storm, and we're here on the Hunter Call of the Wild. They have dogs. They have dogs. And I can pick the colors. A red, whole red, whole liver pigment, liver tan. Oh, like that. I'm gonna go with a female. Name my dog. Oh. Gonna have to have Bubba. My dog in real life. Set is active. Oh, oh, oh. Hello, boy. Hello. So my hunting dog has traits and stuff. Loving. Uh, that's not bad. Higher chance of sensing an animal when it's about to be spooked. Chance of which dog can find blood clue. Oh, like a wolf. Your dog is naturally more willing to work. It has increased focus. Highlight wounded animals you are tracking. Dog has a higher chance of staying close to you. Chance to find wall idle. Predator attacks. You have a more loving relationship, which increases its overall bond. Yeah, I don't know about that. <laughs> that one seems a little strange. Hello, Duke. Hold B to interact. Play low. Pet. Play. Obviously. B is such a weird key. Oh, look at you, my paw. Content. I'm just going to pet you one more time. Come on, boy. What is heal? That means stop. Oh, that means come. Track. <laughs> All right. So based on this, I'm going to go to one of my favorite hunting spots. Just so we can test out the new features. With the Duke. Been a while since I played, guys, so give me that chance. We got ducks. One of my favorite hunting spots on Layton Lake. I am using a 30 up. And my dog is sitting. That looked like a leg for a second. It is raining. Making things a little bit more difficult. See who's been here. You know, I spotted some tracks earlier, close to where you're at right now. I'll send the coordinates. Yeah, the eating zone is still here. Means I haven't totally killed it. I need to like wound something so he can like. We're going to go away from the wind. <laughs> yeah, no, you guys went to the water and disappeared into the ocean. Atlantean deer.
I do like that we have bloodhounds now. Good boy. Not ideal to come up here, but I have put a little bit of pressure in damn ducks. I have put a little bit of pressure on this lake at all times, so let's take a little bit of a walk. I'm always after that buck, too. I'm not usually hunting females as much anymore. Once you don't really need money or levels, it, yeah, I don't shoot everything every, all the time. Then again, for content purposes, for you guys, I tend to shoot more. Now, I've played this game before and gotten off before even hitting anything. Maybe we can track blood using them. This. Let's go track this down. Those mooses shouldn't die. Neither should die. Not the right rifle for it, but... Let's get you some EXP. Not hunting ducks today. I don't have a shot yet. Let's find the blood. Should be around here somewhere. God. Oh, there we go. That. Yes, she found blood. Jesus, enough footprints over here. So he leveled up. But we don't see that. He's already level two. Not bad. A lot of deer in this area at one point. I think this would be a lot more useful in those situations where you shoot something and you're actually trying to find it for like 20 minutes. Like, see how I moved my track? Don't know where I'm going, but he knows. Thought that was a deer. Oh, 
And keep an eye out for deer at the same time. Oh, I did kill the deer. I mean the moose. I see the body, but I want him to find it. And see if it's anything special. Buddy. Okay. Where's your blood trail? See what he does when he finds the kill. Good boy. He's already tired. Yeah, he's tired. And he's my best friend. Look at that. That was quick. So, based on that, we're doing pretty good. That helps him at all. All right. So that's all like ducks. Where else can I go? We'll go here. This is all about the dog. If I sleep, it'll say 5.30 in the morning. We'll do 6.30. He's alert. Alright, he'll stay there. See if I can hit anything over here. It seems good for like big game. Um and just a friend, I guess. Okay, so you can't just tell him to stay. Alright, based on this. We're going to head back down here. We should get some deer sightings. Why did you level up? Just because he's out hunting?
We know there's a white-tailed buck in there. Will he come out for me? Why am I using a, a red deer? Oh, it's a red deer collar. Yep, I remember why. I was hunting red deer the other day. <laughs> There's our buck. 75 meters. Please stop. As I said, I don't usually kill like that, but... Nothing vital. So I don't know, well, like, traits. Like, what those are gonna do. Oh, he's going. Yeah, this is ruined. I broke the freaking jaw. Come on, boy. Usually I should have aimed more center mass. Just to hit vital organs, but give the dog a chance to level up more, I guess. I don't really understand the leveling process. He's attentive and he's my best friend. Where are you going, buddy? Yeah, I need that shortcut trait so he doesn't, like, go each one. That's pretty cool. I do like the new dogs. It's it's a cool thing. It gives you another thing to level up if you're kind of where I am, where you can't level up your character anymore. And then you can have multiple dogs. So if that's what you're looking for, you can do it. Be fun for like turkey and duck hunting too, I guess. They'll have to add the ability for it to get like ducks for you. Oh, look it. All new hunting spots. Don't care about white-tailed jackrabbits, but okay. Alright, so now we should howl. Bubba a girl, I just noticed that. Bubba's a dude. <laughs> Alright guys, well we're going to end here. Thank you guys for joining me for this episode. If you want to see more of the Hunter Call of the Wilds, I'm always willing to bring it back to the channel. Let me know in the comments down below. Try and, you know, like up the video so we can keep it going. And so other people can find it. Adios everybody. Your tongue's weird.